During the uh, IAEA General Conference, which was in September, the government of Japan uh, requested the agency to support by organizing a mission to Japan and, and, and to Fukushima to help in remediation of uh, large contaminated areas of site, the TEPCO Fukushima nuclear power plant. And, and this mission was a response of the agency to this Japanese government request. Well, first of all, we acknowledge, we did eight acknowledgements, finding out several strong things we, we felt that had been done in a very good way. And we provided 12 uh, pieces of, of advice. First of all, I think uh, a lot of good work is ongoing in Japan. The commitment in all levels, national, prefectorate and, and local, was impressive to all of us. So that's the first point I would like to mention. Second thing, we all felt that in the early phase of the accident and early phases of, of the fallout and remediation, it was important that the government did, with the prefectorates, uh, conservative work. In other words, they protected, they remediated more than was perhaps necessary, just to protect people and environment well. Now that uh, the information is coming very well on, on different measurements, different technologies, different methods, we advised to uh, revisit those uh, approaches because we felt that there might be uh, some room for removing the conservatism from some of the activities. In other words, doing only those things that uh, are basically necessary and not uh, cleaning up everything because that would then lead uh, to, uh, first of all, a little bit less waste in, in certain areas and also ease people's burdens uh, a bit more than, than perhaps needed. Now that uh, the information is coming very well on, on different measurements, different technologies, different methods, We advised to uh, revisit those uh, approaches because we felt that there might be uh, some room for removing the conservatism from some of the activities. In other words, doing only those things that uh, are basically necessary and not uh, cleaning up everything. Because that would then lead uh, to, uh, first of all, a little bit less waste in, in certain areas. And also ease people's burdens uh, a bit more than, than perhaps needed. Then the third point I would uh, point out is, is perhaps that uh, not all the soil that has been removed is necessarily radioactive waste. Uh, many other countries uh, experience the same type of issues of how do you define what is waste and not what is not waste. There are lots of examples that uh, how the limit and the limits can be set in a, in a realistic way. So. We encourage uh, Japanese authorities to, to make use of these examples and benefits of, of other countries. And
and thereby also uh, minimizing some amounts of waste used and then having other ways of, of dealing that type of very low uh, active material in recycling, reusing it and, and not just creating a, a challenge how to dispose that, that type of waste. After submitting their report, the IAEA team held a news conference. They touched on the Japanese government plan to decontaminate areas where air annual radiation exposure reaches one millisievert. The one millisievert criteria is a real challenging criteria, but it could be achieved. The only thing is that you need time to do that. Len Tiho also said that most of the soil removed by decontamination work contains low levels of radiation and the possibility of human exposure is low. He suggested there is no need to be overly concerned about radiation exposure.